This looks like a vehicle here that I would imagine uh, is somehow powered by the wind or recharges its battery via those things that turbine or whatever the fans or whatever they are up there. Is, did you build it? You built it? You're the inventor, builder of this? Wow. You want to say your name? No, I have to say. So you have to stay. Oh, really? Okay. Well, you want me to keep this video private or can I? No, no. You can. I want people to spread the word. Okay. I understand. All right. Thank you, sir. Okay. Okay. You want me to, uh, I have your plate on here. Should I, should I edit the plate out? No, no. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. Proud of the plate. You know. Okay. No, the license plate, I'm saying, because they can find out who you are via the plate. No, that's okay. For people you show it to, I'm proud that I got my New York State plate. Okay, but well, you don't want your face on video. Right. Okay. No. I'll make sure that it's not on there. No, I'm keeping my face. Too. No, I'm not. Even if I had on video, I would edit it out before, before I put it online. Does it work via the wind? Yeah, wind power regenerated. Wind power regenerated. Okay, very good, very good. I'm sure I'll come. 65% of the power? Yeah. Where's the rest come from? Battery? Yeah. All right, let's talk more later. My grandfather, uh, my mom's side, perfected the piston ring, actually, so. Uh, you got inventors in you. We got inventors. I have an inventor gene in me, and you obviously have one. Right, <laughs> okay, yeah. thank you, thank you. Okay. Nice to meet you. I'm John, John Rosen. Thanks. His name was Ernie Olson, my grand, my grandfather, and he. Uh, that's a long story. I'll tell it to you another time. They were using all the car companies were using my grandfather's piston ring, and they wanted to pay him a million bucks. This is way back in the early 1900s, like 19 probably 30s. I don't know exactly when, or in the 20s or whatever. And he didn't. He wanted more than a million, and he didn't settle for the million. He fought him the rest of his life in court, and then he married somebody else, and their family. Not my grandmother's, not us, because he married someone else after the Depression, had a new family, and then their whole family was always dragged into court. They don't even like talking about it. So, and then he ended up getting nothing. They exhausted him of all, I guess, all his money. Yeah, I, In the end, he got nothing. I heard the story. The guy.